Hey there, everyone, and welcome to Beyond the Walls announcements for June 9th. Are you just so excited that you just can't stand it? This Sunday, June 13th, we will be back inside the sanctuary for the first time since March 15th, 2020. That's been well over a year ago. So I hope that you have already planned to be here on Sunday morning at 10 a.m. The service will be similar to the services that we've been having outdoors lately. But this Sunday, we're going to have a special event. We're going to recognize our 2021 graduates. So please come on out this Sunday and join us in the sanctuary at 10 a.m. We can't wait to see you. Now on Saturday, this coming Saturday, June 12th, Dig In is planning a garden day out at their property on Blankenship Road. So um, from 10 to 1, you can come out there and see all the things that are going on in the in the garden. Uh, they'll have kids activities and a garden swap. I'm not really sure what that is, but um, sounds like fun to me. And you can do that all for free. And it's at 944 Blankenship Creek, sorry, Blankenship Creek Road in Burnsville. So that's this Saturday. What a fun activity for you and the family to do. So go ahead and, and plan on that for this Saturday. Um, now, the you've been reading a little bit about the PATH Summer Food Program. This is something that First Baptist does every year. And typically, um, someone will coordinate that with our church members, and we will go on a specific day, and we'll all be together. And um, and like I said, that's typically coordinated by one person in our church. But this year, they're asking uh, for us to do it a little bit differently. They have a, uh, a, a website where you can go and actually register online, and they would like for everyone to do that. And then they'll try to uh, coordinate uh, organizations with the same people on the same day. So if you're interested in signing up to be a volunteer for the PATH Summer Food Program, then uh, on Facebook, maybe. If not, I'll add it. But definitely in your weekly email, there is a uh, an article that tells you about that and a link where you can register for the Path Summer Food Program. Now, if you haven't had an opportunity this summer yet to donate blood... <laughs> then uh, I don't know what's been going on with you because there have been multiple opportunities. But I'm telling you, it's not too late because we're going to give you one more opportunity. And that will be on June the 19th. It will be out in our side parking lot where we've normally been having church services. And it will be from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. The folks that are sponsoring this blood drive are uh, the Yancey Animal Advocacy. And they will uh, be hosting this blood drive. And the the this is through the Blood Connection. And the Blood Connection is going to give them $20 for every blood donor. So if you are... Um, if you are a fan of animal advocacy and you are a uh, typical blood donor, then this is the perfect opportunity for you to help two organizations at the same time. So that's Saturday, June the 19th from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. in our parking lot. And you can go to thebloodconnection.org and you have to put in the word the at the beginning because I've tried it and it doesn't work if you don't, thebloodconnection.org, and then search for um, the, the donate. I'm not sure exactly how it is listed, on their website, but uh, but it's not too hard to find. And then you can uh, schedule a time to come and donate blood on the 19th. And also, here's a great ministry opportunity. If you're looking for some volunteer possibilities, Malin Community College is looking for life skills instructors. Um, it is 
um, a part-time position that is available in Mitchell, Avery, and Yancey counties. Uh, you must have a bachelor's degree, so uh, that's something to consider. And the classes meet two to three times per week, depending on the location. Um, you can make a difference with these young adults and, and maybe even some older adults, helping them to learn the necessary life skills to be able to get along in this world. So if you're interested in that, you can call 828-766-1285 or just contact the church office and I'll get you in touch with those folks there over at Mayland. So I hope you guys are looking forward to a wonderful weekend and you are going to uh, begin your day on Sunday right here in our very own sanctuary at 10 a.m. Hope you guys uh, have a great day.